Yo, what is going on guys and welcome back to another video on the channel. Today we're taking a look at the top six brawlers in Brawl Stars. So as you can see, I'm seventh on the Power League uh, leaderboards. And this is actually giving me a really good idea of kind of what the best brawlers are, what people are banning, what people are picking first. So I have a really, really good idea of what the best brawlers are. Let me know down below what you think the best brawler is. Also make sure to like the video. Make sure to subscribe if you're not already. We're getting really close to 150k. Of course, make sure you're using code TOM in the shop if you're picking anything up. And let's get into it. Okay, so at number six, then we have Sprout. So Sprout is an amazing brawler. The only problem with Sprout is that it's really easy to counter. So you can just go like um, a Mortis, a BB, Poco, anything aggro is pretty much going to counter Sprout. So that's why Sprout is at six and not any higher. Looks like they have a bull here. This is going to be pretty tough. I'm going to block that off there. He shouldn't be able to score that. Okay. So yeah, Sprout is amazing for control. Can also be played on literally every single mode as well. So that definitely makes Sprout a lot better. The fact that... Pretty much, uh, with the exception of Showdown, Sprout's just great in every mode. Probably at least A tier, including Heist, because uh, you wouldn't think Sprout would be that good. Looks like this Leon is just, I don't know what this Leon is doing, but Shelly can maybe score. Shelly's against, like, Thru's Hanks here, let's see. Morris? Oh, no. Who might score this? Let's see. Hopefully not. Okay. Maybe. Block that. Okay, hello, Bull. <laughs> Brimo's jumping. No, that's gonna be a goal, is it? No, okay. Why did you... Shelly just passed him the ball on the line. Are you serious, Shelly? Why did you do that? Imagine not playing PSG Shelly on Brawl Ball, which is literally a PSG-themed map, and you don't play PSG Shelly. Like, what are you doing? Okay, Shelly's here. Nice. Mortis going for a trick shot. Can you get it? I, these random Mortises, man. I swear. Can block that there. Okay, that block actually somehow worked there. There was two people <laughs> jumping, and we still managed to block it. Shelly, you need to get that kill. Otherwise, we're going to lose. Please. Nice. Is this actually... Okay, that's a fake one. I'm guessing he's here. Yeah, he is. Okay. This is tough. This is definitely a tough matchup here. You can pass. Shelly? Okay. Pass, Morse. Ah, oh, that's going to be a GG, I think. Unless Morse can get me the ball. Looks like he is. going to stop that. Ah! Primo! This... Facing tanks as a Sprout is really bad. But if you face any kind of low HP brawler, Sprout's going to be really good. I wouldn't always pick Sprout first in Power League. I'd probably pick him, try and pick him last or at least second to last because that way you know you're going to have some good matchups. Um, so any, anyone with low HP is going to be a good matchup here, but this is going to be a loss. Unfortunately, as I said, you know, Sprout just cannot deal with that aggro, but it's really good when it's control. Okay, so number five, then we have Byron. Byron is actually really good in every single mode. But Byron has fallen a little bit down the ranks just because on those kind of close range maps, I feel like Mr. P is better, Sprout is better sometimes, um, and you kind of have to build the comp around Byron. But it's definitely still a really OP comp. You can use like Byron BB, but I just feel like Byron on his own isn't that strong anymore, even though, I don't know, he hasn't had any nerfs. I just feel like people have learned how to play against him, and it looks like everybody is teaming. No Bs in Showdown, it's just other people teaming now. That's not good to see. Okay, we can try and get his Tara maybe. I'm gonna shoot there. Okay, we're gonna hit the Tara. There is someone here, maybe. There's a Pam. Okay. We are just tapping up the whole lobby right now. Um, I guess we just hold this mid right now. It's really hard. Right. <laughs> is is anyone not spinning? Yo, this isn't this is this is solo showdown. Okay, it looks like everybody's teaming. Maybe apart from this. Nope, the BB's teaming as well. So I think there's nine people teaming. That's sad to see. Who do we go for? I don't I honestly do not know who to go for. Okay, Pam's maybe going to go down. BB's going for Pam. Okay, BB's going to get that kill. And maybe get this BB, actually. Okay. Looks like we lost the BB there. Primo, though, trying to get this BB. Going to shoot that. Honestly, just going to stay mid so we know where, where everyone is. Primo trying to dodge us here, but we are hitting quite a bit. Looks like Primo had to waste super there. Just going to continue to shoot this bull right here. Oh, no. What is, what is he doing? Okay, nice. One shot. Nice, okay, I think 12 HP, are you serious? <laughs> nice, Shelly, okay. Well played, Shelly. Good kill. Is this one up here? So it went from a full lobby of teamers till still pretty much a full lobby of teamers. Got to keep this Tara away. Is pretty much seriously going to... BB? Oh my god, there's, there's too much teaming in Showdown. Okay, so at number three then. No, at number four, we have Max. So Max is just OP in every single mode, pretty much. Can literally just carry your team... Um, and yeah, Max is just super OP. Looks like we got the randoms here that don't play. So, you hate to say it, we're just going to have to carry. It looks like... Mm, Sprout's mid. Ape is doing a good job, to be fair. Going to speed our Jesse. But I don't know if it's going to help. Okay. We can get this uh, Colt, maybe. Colt's going down. Nice. 
Okay, hopefully our Jesse plays and it should be okay. But yeah, as you can see, Max is just really good. Pretty versatile, can use him in pretty, or use her in pretty much any mode. And just a really solid, solid option. Um, we should be able to get this kill here. Gonna just dash through that, tank that there. And yeah, Apex gonna put turret there. Not the best place for a turret, but honestly, you can melt the safe, so we'll take it. Okay. <laughs> Looks like they rage quit. I don't know. Did they rage quit? I kind of think they rage quit. We go here. So this is actually power league, by the way, if you didn't realize already. Because, yeah, I prefer power league randoms than normal randoms and showdown teaming. So I hope you guys, <laughs> hope you guys like this gameplay. Um, should definitely sh show you um, what kind of randoms you can expect. But anyway, anyone, everyone always thinks I get OP randoms, so we'll see about that. Sprout is going down. They're going to block the safe here, but it's not really going to do anything. We have the, like, extra speed star power, and we can just melt the safe. That's a GG. Okay, then, so at number three, we have Mr. P. Mr. P is just OP, as his name suggests. Um, we're going to be using Revolving Door, but yeah, if you get first pick and uh, Stu and Ruffs have been banned, Mr. P is always going to be a great first pick. Just ignore the fact that I just got right there, please, and focus on how OP Mr. P is. So yeah, his gadget has just made him even better. We are going to be using Revolving Door. On the closed maps, you can use Revolving Door. Um, this Sprout is being so annoying, so we're going to lob a gadget on him. But yeah, honestly, we're, we're, we're struggling right now. <laughs> we just need to get our super. As soon as we grab our super, that is just going to carry, essentially. Okay, this Rico's being slightly annoying. We're about to get Rico there. Rico's going to go down. Nice. Okay. Let's just stay here for a second and just grab this zone. But yeah, Mr. P literally so OP in every single mode. As I said, you can use Revolving on those close range maps and just the other star power on the other maps. And as soon as you get Super, it's just going to keep spamming pause and they're just going to be shooting them pretty much the whole game and not have any time to shoot you. So yeah, it's just so OP to be honest. Okay, Sprout's missing shots. This Sprout's not bad, you know. Okay, no, this part's bad. <laughs> nah, this part's okay, this part's okay. Dine is sitting here. We still need a lot of left-hand side. So as soon as we get this one, we're going to move over there. Just shoot here. I know Sprout's coming up. Okay. <laughs> we got right there, but yeah. It, we do kind of count on Sprout a little bit because he has to keep shooting these uh, porters, which keep spawning. Should be a kill there. Nice, okay. Going to go on the left-hand side and help my team here, but it looks like this is going to be a dub. Uh, Mr. P just OP on this map. <laughs> Literally, Mr. OP is never going to be a bad pick. Like, if I'm playing with randoms and they pick Mr. P, no matter the map, I'm going to be happy because he's just OP. Okay, so the second best brawler right now, new brawler, Stu. Stu is just so good on every single mode. It's unbelievable. The gadget as well. The gadget feels like it's a super. That's how OP it feels. That's how my teammates went dynamite, of course. Why would randoms not go dynamite? That just... No, of course randoms went dynamite. Anyway, yeah, they've got a pretty strong comp here, honestly, compared to our comp with uh, Dynamite. <laughs> but look at this, Stu, look at the Stu BB interaction. Tell me that this Brawler is not broken. <laughs> I can't believe you get soup after one shot. That just seems so OP to me. I don't know if I'll change that, but Stu, I feel like Stu, Stu needs enough. The only way to counter Stu is with Ruffs or Mr. P, I would say. But apart from that, you can't really counter Stu. You just have to not feed him that first uh, kind of that first super because as soon as he gets one super, he can just cycle them. So you, on long range maps, Stu's not like crazy good. But if you can get one super, then as I said, you can just cycle them. Like look at that. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna shoot the port by accident there. We need to grab our super again. Looks like. Barley is going down here. Um, uh, Dynamite went down. I'm going to just do this because we can. Um, and yeah, this Brawler is <laughs> needs enough. It's pretty broken. EB is one shot here. Don't want to go for that, actually. EB is in the corner, probably. Nope. Should be able to get these in mid here. Let's try and get these. I went down, unfortunately. Hopefully, Dynamite can get those few bolts. And we should be good for this last boss here. But yeah, Stu... Stu is great in Siege, great in Barubo, honestly, literally so good in every single mode. The only mode that I'm, I'm a bit iffy is like Bounty, just because some maps are really long range, like Shooting Star. And you can kind of count as Stu, but yeah, Stu still just so, so OP. Hopefully we can win this here. Against BB, like, it's just such an easy matchup, like, hey, I got Super, hey, I got Super, hey, I got Super, and you're dead, you know? It's just so easy. <laughs> you can just spam all to aim, and honestly... It's like a better version of Max, and Max is already OP. Like, I just cycle infinite supers here. This is going to be another win here. Pretty comfortable in this one. 
even Mr. P can't really counter us that well if we play it good and dash away from that shot there because we don't get, we don't get hit by it. But yeah, this is a pretty easy dub right here, as you can see. Against throwers, like you get one super and they just can't do anything. Same with tanks, pretty much same with everything. Stu is just OP. Okay, so at number one, we have Ruffs. Ruffs is just like a brutal, like no other brutal in the game. The ability to kind of level up your teammates, not only with health, but also just with upgrades. Why is my whole team going here? I don't know why, but I kind of like it, to be honest. <laughs> that was kind of different. Okay. Get the Sprout. Uh, the Searcher got the Sprout, and that was an easy kill. Just allowed this Sprout to stay alive there for no reason, and now we're going to get pinched in. Surge really should have killed that Sprout. Okay. Nice. Good kill there. Surge going to go down here. Rico Super. We might go down, yeah. Rico's gonna super us here. We need to get them off this right-hand zone. They have Mr. P Sprout. They have a really toxic comp here. I honestly wouldn't go Surge. And Jesse's honestly not the best pick when they have no tanks. So, not the best picks from my teammates here. Let's see if we can get this kill. I'm just gonna take this upgrade. Literally, my teammates, they are doing nothing anyway. So, I might as well just take this. Uh, okay, gonna get that down there. Just gonna push this Mr. P, actually. Should have been an easy kill. Nice, good kill there. And then we're gonna push around and hopefully help our teammates out here. Chuck that back there for them. Nice. Teammates can push this. Nice. Got the kill there. Okay. Someone get that upgrade, please. Someone get that upgrade. Someone get the upgrade. It's a free upgrade. Just take it. Thank you. Ah! Another upgrade. Take the upgrades. Please take the upgrades. Surge, take the upgrade, please. Okay. I don't know what zone we got. I'm pretty sure we must have got right, surely. Okay. You got the upgrade. Perfect. Okay, those upgrades definitely carried us there. That's going to be a win. Super close game. Okay, guys, that's going to wrap it up for the video. Also, Rose and Amber really OP, but they didn't quite get into the top six. Anyway, make sure you subscribe. Make sure you're using code Tom in the shop, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.